Hello students. So this is the second part of this chapter matter from class 6 chemistry. We have studied about the states of matter on the first part of this chapter, isn't it? So then in the second part, let's study. What we'll study? We'll study about the arrangement of the molecules. So as matter exists in three states, solid, liquid, gas, so they have some arrangement of the molecules. How the molecules in the solids, how the molecules of the liquids and gases were distributed. Let's see one by one, okay? Let's get started. Molecules in solids. So molecules in solids are closely packed. One after one and that means they had a very good bonding between them. And what will happen if they have a good very bonding it will not go means all are so friends to each other all help each other all are friends to each other means they have a fixed position in their place. So they are almost fixed and they will retain their shape and have a very fixed volume. In your table what is there? Your laptop, your mobile phone, your pencil box, your pencil, your pen, your book, your copy all are what? Solids. And whatever molecules are there inside it they are very closely packed. Okay. Next we will go to molecules in the liquids. So molecules and liquids are not slow, so closely packed. Means there inside them some, some enemies are also there. Okay. In the liquids what happened the, in the, within the molecules they are not so friendly to each other. Okay, they are jealous of each other, each one of each other, the molecules. I just, I'm just kidding, okay, students. So, here the liquids will change their shape, but they have their own volume. Like a glass of milk, okay, like uh, your milkman came to your house. He has given one uh, liter of milk, okay. He has taken one cylindrical vessel. He has taken one liter of milk and it is given to in your pan. So that pan is about 2 liters, okay. As he has given 1 liter there, so it will be about half of the pan, isn't it? So the same volume will be there, but it will change their shape, okay. So there is a arrangement of molecules in the liquid. Next, in gases, what we will study? In gases, their molecules are far apart and it will not be compared to other solids or liquids means they are all our enemies to each other no one will see each other okay if they st just strictly strike also each uh, to each other they bump each other they will soon go go away go away i don't want to talk with you means all our enemies the molecules of gases are all our enemies they are very free to move okay so gases therefore neither have a very fixed shape or a fixed volume and they take the shape of the shape or volume of the closed container they are kept in but it should be closed not open okay so this is the arrangement of molecules in the gases now the main thing is that what is the effect of this arrangement now see when the solid is heated the molecules get extra energy and they begin to vibrate at their position and gradually move away from that position slowly means one particle another particle will go to move away slowly that heated thing the heat will move pass away and the distance between the molecules which increase resulting in the conversion of solid state to the liquid state. And on heating a liquid what happens? The molecules will acquire more energy and they will start moving with a higher speed. And those molecules which are near the surface after acquiring more energy will escape from the liquid as vapors as a gaseous state of matter. Okay, and when a gas is cooled, then the speed of the molecules will decrease on cooling, and the density will increase, and the intermolecular space will decrease. The molecules will come closer to one another, and the gas then change into liquid state. So these are the effect. What happens when a solid, liquid, and a gas is heated or cooled? Clear? So this second part of this chapter is finished. Now we will study the effect of heat of on matter on the third part of this chapter. So till then, thank you students. Stay safe and stay good. Bye-bye.